Hey everybody, Psychosaurus is here, welcome back to H.O. Empires Online, and today we're gonna do another legendary quest here in Londinium, and this is gonna be the last one from Crassus, It Takes a Pillage. And just like with the previous two, I'm going in completely blind, I have no idea what this quest is gonna be about, what the map looks like, I know nothing, it's my first time. So, it seems that the start is very similar to the other two. Seems like we start with the auxiliar camp here, which is nice. Okay, there's an auger, and it's with sheep. Well, that's nice. Okay, so let, let's play a little bit with the ogre. Okay, didn't work out, shame. But we got him. <laughs> oh boy, we got him. So it's fine. So yeah, the objective. What's the objective? So defeat enemies, train only ranged and villagers. So that includes caravans as well. And I already see carpentons here. And I don't like it. Well, it is what it is. Let's go. We got some sheep here, so that should... Make sure we don't have to worry about the food production. But let's bu let's build a wall here. So that's gonna be the first task. Let's kill a bear. It's gonna be straight up great. Killing a bear. Okay, let's, let's build walls. Definitely we don't wanna see them coming from where you don't want them to come from. Let's add more hunters. Good. We're gonna place the market right here. Afterwards, there's some nice slinger running around. So, what can I expect? A lot of ranged units. If it's gonna be just like with the previous two, then it's gonna be just straight up a lot of ranged units. And this is a free star, so I'm definitely expecting it. To be more challenging than the previous two. It's gonna be fun. Okay, straight up building the. Yeah, that's what I was expecting. Okay, I could probably. Them come. Great. Move it, you boar. Yeah, so it's not that bad. We just need few slingers to defend ourselves. That's just nice. Okay, ma map is definitely not that big. Okay. 
Okay, we can go hunting. There you are. Okay, where's... We can build this. How much gold are we generating? It's not much. It's definitely shorter range than I would appreciate. But it's alright. That's why I got crosses here. So we have more than enough gold. Okay. See, that's how you go hunting. <laughs> That should be all of them. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely not gonna be nice once we get closer to the carp and tombs and they are champions, that's not nice. Okay, I would truly appreciate Celtic Slingers are super annoying. <laughs> okay, let's get the armory. I could use the champion upgrade, that would be very nice. To be honest. Okay, but I need gold. Let's get gold. slow this early oh boy here we go again okay stone them what oh boy they are annoying as we can see okay upgrade I can build towers right that's nice That's what I get for having <laughs> very vulnerable slingers. <laughs> but it is what it is. So it's not a big issue. Okay, but I need the food. I need this. Let's age up. Let's get the Krasus up and running. After that, we don't have to worry about caravans. Okay, let's get the damage output. Let's get more slingers. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's what you get. Okay, no more boars. That's not nice, but it's alright. You got my gold income. Citizenship. Should I go Cretan Bowman even? I mean, I'm gonna need some extra health here. But I guess I should be fine with just slingers. Man, why are you annoying? Why are you so annoying? Could use the upgrade. Okay, we got this good. Let's see what Slingers can do. Also, I could have picked Pompey for this, but because my Slingers don't have much health, neither do the Bowmen, it is what it is. And it's not gonna be nice either way, so... Okay, let's build up. Let's get those towers. Okay, Siege begins. These slingers have necessarily like bad damage output, but okay. I was thinking, which Sif should I pick for this? It has to be the worst one. And so I thought, it's either gonna be the Norse or Romans. And I thought, Norse at least have the huge range. They might not be the strongest, but they have the huge range. So I thought, okay, let's go Romans. I was correct. It, it is about the number of resources. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. 
Or wood needed, please. <laughs> They're getting one shot at it. That's not nice. <laughs> But at least they are cheap, like 19 wood, 12 gold, 22 wood, 19 gold. It comes the fortress, please tell me it has 45,000 health. Man, this is just great, man. Fortress is 35,000 health, cause why not? <laughs> this is where I'm gonna complain, okay? Why do fortresses need to have that amount of health? At least uh, when you were supposed to train ranged units only. That's where I find it really, really dumb. And yes, I could go with Bowman, which would probably be better, but then it would not be so much fun. <laughs> I could probably micro this fortress, but I don't feel like to. And 30 DPS, I'm gonna win this with 30 DPS, cause why not? <laughs> cause why not, right? I kind of wish I had now more the Divine High Vizier than the Summer Event West, but then it would not be such fun, right? Would not be such an enjoyable experience, which is not either way, but whatever. Stone them. Hey, what does it feel like? You're doing 20,000 damage to a building and now you have to realize I need to do 5 times as much because of the armor. <laughs> and those slingers do 30 DPS <laughs> each. That's just not gonna be fast. <laughs> okay, we're done here. I'm definitely not looking at the <laughs> graph of how many units died, definitely not after this. Man, screw the sheep, I don't want the sheep.
And there's more to come, oh my god. This is so slow. <laughs> I've started this and I'm gonna complete this. I don't care. <laughs> okay, where are you? Oops. Oh my god, there's more. No. And they have carpentops. Oh boy, hopefully this will be worth it. Probably not, but still. <laughs> Something good might drop. That's a pretty solid damage, like... Oh yeah, I do five times. Even the Carpentons die so fast, too. damage this is <laughs> oh there's a foot no why Why do we need a fortress there? Come on! <laughs> or rather, why do those fortresses need so much health? <laughs> oh my god! See, strong economy. <laughs> it does a lot. <laughs> In the easier quest, definitely. <laughs>
Fortress down. We're gonna be done, right? They did not surrender yet? What? What? What do you mean they did not surrender yet? <laughs> Don't tell me there's one more. <laughs> Some guys out there here, even. So, you're telling me go find guys out there or what? Come on, man. You're not nice. Clear the camps while while we are here. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Fourth one. What? Up on the cliff, man. I hope there's not a fifth one. There's a villager. I see you there. Get back here. Come back. You need a stone in your face. Yeah, there's another base, are you serious? No way. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Open up. I'm going in.
They gave up. Oh, there it is. Oh my god. We did it with slingers. Yay. It's a slaughter. Okay. Oof. Many slingers lost. Many slingers lost. Wow, oh, I'm out of wood. <laughs> Just in time. <laughs> oh boy, so as you could see, be ready for some early slingers. So if you have your your own slinger, skirmisher or whatever, it's gonna be ideal. Otherwise, yeah, it's gonna be Bowman, so yeah, make sure you have enough range to this, or you could actually build a tower that should work as well. Tower should be fine, so that should be fine as well. Build a wall, build towers, so you defend easily, and then just spam a lot. And I have some slingers here, why? Okay, I hope that's the last camp right there. Okay. Oof, so many slingers lost their life this day. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> so yeah, while we are taking the last camp... Let's talk about the camp. So, as we can see, there are four in total. That's what I can see. So, first one, from your starting location, you destroy the first base, you continue north, here's your first treasure camp. Now you, we are going to the second base, we are at the second base, if we go to the east, there's a second treasure camp, if we go south from the second base, there's a third treasure camp, and then we are going towards the right base, but if we go to the left, up here on the cliff, that's where we get the last treasure camp and now I just need to grab those well that was brutal I just want I just want to see okay so you have like 31 DPS but like very good bonus against range units that's why they were doing really well you would do how much 57 but you also have Igno armor, so definitely would be fast to destroy buildings. But it would be worse at dealing with the ranged units. But since you're so cheap, I don't think it would be such a problem. Okay, we need to take those. Did we get them? One, two, three, four. Hopefully, I did not miss anything. I don't see anything on the minimap. Let's go home. So yeah, as you could see, build up, build towers. To defend early or just train your train your own skirmishers. So this was a three star three day, so definitely better rewards to be expected from this one. So 60 empire points, 4,000 coins, five three star legendary chests, only ranged units, thousand coins, and two extra chests. So pretty solid reward. Yes, yes, definitely don't do what I did. Or at least not with the Roman Slingers, that's what I'm going to say. And we got Swift Orc, well that's not nice. And Heavy Destroyer, which is somewhat weak. Well, not the worst rewards. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. And if you did, please press the like button. If you want to see more, subscribe to the channel. And definitely look forward to the... Quest against the Romans. Next time. So yeah, this was Takosaurus. See you next time. Bye.